Welcome to another pixelforlife.com video tutorial. In this lesson, we're going to learn how to take this pieces of a box and create an actual 3D box in Photoshop. Uh, first thing I want to do is go ahead and create a folder and just call this original, which is just going to be the pieces. And the reason I'm creating this is just simply so that I can give this to y'all so you can download it later on. I'll then duplicate that, hide that original, and now we can get to work. This is not really that difficult of a process. It's just um, making sure that you have all the right pieces. So the first thing that I want to do is go ahead and grab this side over here. Go to Edit, Transform, and go to Distort. And from there, I'm going to hold down Shift and drag up and also drag down. And then I'm also going to just drag this in to about there. Now, once I've done that, I'm going to drag this up a little bit and this one down a little bit and hit enter. I'm then going to grab the main section here and I'm going to line up the edges. And then I'm going to downsize this so that that edge there lines up. And then I'm going to hold down the control key and click this corner over here, which will allow me to drag it kind of over into this corner. And the same thing over here. Just trying to kind of keep the proportions somewhat similar to, uh, to what they need to be. And now this top part here, I need to go ahead and drag like this. Kind of put it like that. And basically I'm trying to simulate like the lid being open. So, kind of like that. And looks pretty good. I'm going to go over here to view and take snapping off so that I can just kind of move this around the way that I want. That looks pretty good there. About like that. And that way we can change the background whenever we want. And now I'm going to go ahead and hit Control T. I'm going to scale this down a little bit. That looks pretty good. All right, I'm going to make another duplicate of this. And this one here, I'm going to hit Control T. Actually, just go to uh, Edit, Transform, and flip it vertically. Kind of scroll that down a little bit like that. I'm then going to zoom out of my image here. Go ahead and use my Crop tool. Crop that down like that. And then going to select my Gradient tool. Make sure it's on white. Create a new layer above that. Starting here, hold down Shift, click down. My bad, actually up. Kind of like that. You can go back to this crop tool, cut it out right there. Hit Control T. Kind of squinch that up a little bit and down. And then I can cut that out again. Go to View, Actual Pixels. Zoom out just a little bit. And then I can go ahead and just fill this entire background layer with white. And there you go. That's how you create a simple cereal box in Photoshop 3D. You can use any kind of combinations that you want of images for cereal boxes, software boxes. You can even make the sides yourself and then do this. Uh, whatever you want to do. It's really up to you. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick lesson. Be sure to leave a comment below. Hit that like button and let us know that you loved it. And be sure to check back soon for more tutorials. Thanks, guys.